ionic system. The ionic search system has been developed according to a completely new technology, which is the first of its kind in metal detectors and represents a major improvement over the traditional system that existed before, where the new technology allows for more accurate detection of ion fields resulting from metal targets buried underground thanks to the intelligent multi-transceiver unit, IMTU, that ensures accurate reception and processing of signals the ability to control some of the signal settings on the screen to ensure accurate results. Device installation. One, connect the IMTU probe to the device. Note, make sure that the antenna's unit lock is closed, so the unit must be stable during use. Two, use the power socket on the bottom of the main unit to connect the battery. Note, immediately after entering any search system from the main menu, a video will appear which will notify the device's assembly steps. System selection. To start user, select the Ionic system from the main menu. Then press the OK button. After the selection, a screen will appear, which includes the following elements. Signal sensitivity. It is a signal sensitivity indicator presented in the form of a circular indicator whose value is in percentages. During the search process, according to scanning the surrounding area in search for targets, the ionic system will make a special sound that represents the target's ability and is related to the value of the distance between the user and the target. The user can change the sensitivity value at any time to be able to analyze the resulting sound, whose intensity changes according to the target distance. Gain. It is a value that represents the signal strength and is represented in the form of a circular indicator, whose value is also represented in percentages. User can control signal strength using this option. To set the device to detect large targets, decrease this value, and increase this value for detection of small targets. To select and change the two previous indicators, use the left-right arrow buttons, then press OK. To change the value, use the up-down arrow buttons, and then OK. How to use. After the setup is complete, be sure to assemble the device exactly as shown in the assembly part of this manual. Then hold the device like the image below. During this system, we press the start button to reset. Then we move the device slowly up and down with the same speed, while the device is slightly lowered towards the ground. In the case of a close signal, it will appear on the ionic indicator on the screen. The indicator increases with the increase in the signal strength, or as we approach the target. In conjunction with the issuance of a gradual acoustic alert, the increase in the signal strength, the indicator appears in red if there are metals. And the indicator appears in blue if there are spaces. To make sure the signal is correct, we do a reset by pressing the start button once, but in a different direction than the one from which the signal was picked up the first time. This step is repeated more than once. If the signal continues to appear, this means that the signal is completely correct. Warning, you should not reset the signal from the side because it will lose the signal and the device will deal with it as a normal level of the signal.